What's up, y'all? So, Joel 2.0, side chick reveals belly and confirm new baby. <sighs> like, I... Let's just get into this video. That damn Joel crazy as hell, okay? Let's get into this video. Grab your snacks. Mm -hmm. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you leave. Frankly, I think Joel is rich and bored. I think he is rich and bored. And honestly, I think Lauren is too. <laughs> My bad, y'all. Like, Joel has gotten to the point where he is accumulating about $100,000 a month. Now, Joel went from broke, red couch, to $100,000 a month. Now, to some people, that may sound cliche, because people be throwing numbers out here like, that ain't a lot of money. <laughs> Baby, that's a lot. Now, I feel like he don't know what to do with his day, um, and I feel like he ain't got nothing else to do but grab women and uh do to do you know what i'm saying um is that acceptable no he's married he shouldn't be doing none of that but lauren is letting him do this she's letting him get away with it and i'm sorry but joel is worse than court because somebody just said stp just said uh joel and Corey. no Joel way worse than Corey. This boy is disrespectful. He basically called that girl crazy, psycho, blah, blah, blah. The, be the best thing people like to do when they in the wrong. They like to call you crazy, okay? <laughs> and he called her crazy, a stalker and some old shit. Uh, she ain't got this, she ain't got that. And, um... I say letting him because she's still going back to him. He's cheating openly and she's accepting him back. That's letting him. Okay. If she were to say, you're not cheating on me no more and I'm going to divorce you. She's no longer letting him. You get what I'm saying? So smart. That's letting him. Um, this girl also went back to Joel after he played her several times okay there's some disrespectful shit okay both sides and i think he's winning <clears throat> because he got a bag and clearly he gives out good sausage okay now with 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 both of these is just a toxic thing <laughs> either way but they are accepting this toxicity so i don't feel bad for neither one of these women. I just wanted to put that out there. Y'all make sure y'all get him for everything he got. He get $100,000 every month? Baby, I would at least be having twenty dollars to $30,000 going in my bank account every month. If you think I'm going to just let you play me this way, and let's just say I'm going to let you play me this way. I'm going to let you. Y'all, you have women out here that say, all right, bet. I'm going to let you do that. But you got to run me my 20 to 30 every month. Okay? I don't give a damn what you giving her. I want my 20 to 30. They seem as though they can mentally deal with another woman in the picture. So as far as I'm concerned, it's an open relationship. They might as well start going on picnics together with their babies. Because now he got another baby with her. I mean, yeah, call me crazy. But that's what this is giving. Let's watch this video. If you have not seen that video yet, Lauren reveals that Joelle has another baby on the way with a different woman. Now, Lauren and Joelle are no longer together because of this reason. And the side chick who's pregnant, which is Asia. Y'all remember Asia with the girl with the tattoo on? Now she, she happy as responded to some comments on her Instagram and confirmed that she is indeed pregnant. Somebody commented, shaking my head, he can't help old girls with total vibe, but she shouldn't F with them no more. She got no kids and she's actually on an up and rising, but if she F up and get pregnant, then hello, modern woman, she lose value. Asia responded back, thanks for the comment, but I Damn. 
baby girl. How you going to say she lose value? Damn, people in they comments and the shit that they say. Hold on, y'all. Y'all know I got my little refrigerator. I need me something to drink. Uh, she a lose value? Like what? <laughs> Girl, which is my biggest blessing and one on the way. And women with children don't. Then just spew out false narratives. She got a whole child talking about she don't have a child. Like <laughs> lose any value. They actually gain true queens in my eyes. Then somebody else said one on the way. Is it Joelle's? Probably. I don't see how she feels okay going with somebody's husband who runs back and forth and no telling who. Now that's the part that's terrible. To be a baby mother to somebody's husband. <laughs> Agent responded back. I understand that and thank you. But it's a lot of y'all women judging me off of my mistakes as if y'all don't make any. I'm not perfect, not even close. And I had my reason as to why I was messing with him off camera. And what y'all don't see is me being told something totally different. No, I I know what you're being told, cause I, first of all, Joelle be giving slow anyway, but you know he basically told her that uh, Lauren and Joelle was about to break up, but you can't just break up. I also feel as though when you are separated, <coughs> I feel like you can mess with whoever you mess with, you want to mess with when you're separated. But Joelle don't make it look better when he come back on the internet and be back with Lauren. Like, nigga, pick a poison. Like, what are you doing? I was only dealing with him when they weren't together. Since they're married, they're always together. I'm a strong woman. If I could take care of my first child without her dad's help, I most definitely and will take care of my second without his help. I laid there so I could take care of my responsibilities. So to answer your question, yes, I'm pregnant with his child. Not only did she confirm, but she posted and deleted this video. The caption that says, I've made my mistakes, but I will never look at you as one of them. I'm convinced that this is what sis wanted all along. Remember she was tore up about the whole miscarriage situation and she was crying which joelle went and said that he didn't even want any kids he said i don't want no more kids I but went and put a baby right back in her and i honestly feel like he did it <clears throat> because he wanted the baby to look a certain way i'm not even gonna lie to y'all this girl and let me use my words right because i ain't got time for y'all let's just go with this this is a pretty girl okay now for him to get her pregnant she have a miscarriage and him to say he don't want no kids till suddenly she pregnant again. I don't know if that's just a, like one of them, uh, I ain't having a condom situation. But if you knew you could get her pregnant the first time, don't you think you would wrap it up to not get her pregnant again? I feel like he wanted to get her pregnant for that reason. Okay. Uh, so yeah. And then the tattoo, it's just a lot with that. I just want to have a good time. She's taking this thing too serious. Then you go and sleep with this girl again and get this girl pregnant. I don't know what's going on with the men on YouTube, but all I want to know is, Lauren, what's your limit? Where do you draw the line girl, at some she point? Got because no line. now he got another girl pregnant. You already got three kids. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think on that whole situation. Now, in my previous video, I did mention that I'm going to go live, but I'm going to go live on my second what? channel. I ran into a couple of... Excuse me. There is no line. There is no line with Lauren. I believe that Lauren, <sighs> Lauren either like this toxic shit or she just don't want to lose Joel. I mean, uh, <laughs> that's all I can say. Like somebody that may be stupid to y'all, she may think that she's the smartest woman in the world when it comes to this situation. And to be quite honest with you, everybody throws opinions out of their ass, which we all have, is an ass. Oh, that's an opinion. It don't matter what you think. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter what I think. We don't know what's going on behind the scenes. If I was her... Nigga gonna cheat on me, bet. I'm gonna have me a side nigga and you gonna be giving me twenty to $30,000 a month. I don't know why these women not playing their cards correctly. And even if he decide that he wanna, you know, go crazy and, and, and <laughs> approach the other nigga, I'm, the t I'm gonna have to tell the other nigga. Bruh, listen, I know I, I fuck with you, I rock with you, I just want you to know I am married though, but my husband be cheating on me. <laughs> Unfortunately, he makes $100,000 a month and no, you're not gonna touch him because you're not gonna fuck up. The money that is coming to my children. But I'll probably slide your cool five or something, you know, monthly to uh, do what you need to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Slide me that the good day. And um, yeah, we figure this out from here. I'm going to have me something to fall back on now. Call me toxic. But I'm just saying in this situation, if I was her, that's what I would, would be doing. And the other girl probably would do the same. At the end of the day, uh, you're not about to just play me like this. And, you know, you making $100,000 a month. I don't even want your amount, but you're going to give me something. 
you know. And it's going to be way more than 10, 20. I, don't play with me. You know, this pussy's golden. So, yeah. We all don't think the same. Of course, y'all going to leave y'all comments and say what y'all think that's cool with me. Until next time.